when it comes to endpoints. Domotes is able to provide you with immediate insights on their status and also delivers advanced monitoring capabilities. From the inventory dashboard, you can access the complete device list and by selecting the devices section, you'll be able to search, access, and manage all your devices. For example, by clicking on the drop-down menu under the type column, I can filter for all my printers in all my sites, search for all my desktops, or for all the IP security cameras. On the left, there is the status column that allows you to filter devices and check if devices are online or not. I can also configure additional advanced monitoring depending on the device type. I can filter my devices for the ones that use SNMP sensors like a printer. By clicking on View Details, I'll be able to access the SNMP tab. There, I can check the toner level and other printer supply usage. This information is grouped in one easy-to-read table. On a UPS, which we can find by searching for UPS in the search bar and then clicking on the device name. By accessing the SNMP section, I can check its battery status, voltage, temperature, and the remaining charge and other values. If I click on the drop-down menu under the type column, I'll be able to search for a NAS in order to check disk health and the amount of space remaining on each disk partition. If we search for another example, we can look for Windows workstations in our devices list. When monitoring Windows workstations by clicking on the dedicated system section tab, I can monitor its system properties such as CPU, memory information and usage, disk integrity, and again, each disk partition being able to see its size and usage. Going on, if I click and access Domote's Custom Drivers tab, I will be able to check if these workstations require critical updates. See a complete list of available updates. And in addition, monitor if they require a reboot. If they do, I can reboot them with a single click directly from our software. Needless to say, on each of these sensors, SNMP sensors, operating system monitoring sensors, or custom driver sensors, I can create an alert by clicking the bell icon next to the variable name, for example, memory used. Here, I can define a condition that, if triggered, will send an email notification or open a ticket depending on the contact channel I configured in DOE modes. For example, I can create an alert on a disk usage value to be notified when it is above the 85% threshold. I can select an option from the drop-down menu and write the corresponding value in the space on the right. After that, I'll select the contact that wants to be notified when the event occurs or a predefined ticketing system. As we can see, when clicking on the bell, if the value goes above 85%, I will get an email notification. Domotes has also developed advanced monitoring features for OnVIF IP security cameras. Clicking on Access Manager, you'll be able to unlock the device management. Once unlocked using the OnVIF credentials, you will be able to enter the camera section, giving access to its video properties. And Camera Capabilities section, useful for diagnostics and functional check purposes. Note that team leaders and team members will be able to take camera snapshots and perform video streaming on demand. For privacy reasons, images taken from the camera are not stored on the Domotes cloud. Also, Domotes sends an email to the end client every time you activate the snapshot or video streaming feature. For this reason, an end client email must be configured in the customer tab for this agent.